at how you read all my books, treating me like some kind of a hero? You are a hero! I'm not! I'm just a man, like anybody else. And your thinking otherwise is just a bit more weight than I'm willing to carry. Hell, I can't even handle the responsibilities I already got. Why don't you let me try to help you? It's too late. Cody? What are you doing here, Teaspoon? Doc and I was wondering if you'd give us a hand, Mr. Horn. Doing what? We're heading out to the Kiowa village. We need somebody who can speak the language. Where's Buck? Buck's on the run. Word has it, villagers are real sick. What do you mean, sick? Don't look good. Ha, ma. Bane, ha, that, ma. That's not going to do any good. The medicine's not going to work. Do you understand? Tell her the poultice won't do any good. Wants to know what's wrong with the child. Smallpox. I think these blankets may be contaminated. Like them ones they sent the tribes on the Missouri? Teaspoon, can you track down the source of this shipment? Yeah, I know where they came from. Webster. How do you know that? Because I saw a few of his men unloading them back in town and giving them off to Braves. It ain't the boy's fault. Look, how it started doesn't matter now. What we got to do is stop it from spreading. I mean, we've got to set up a quarantine until we can get a serum from St. Joe. We gotta burn the village. I'll get to work. Perfect. We tell the Indian we want to put him on a reservation so we can help him. What we're really doing is getting them together so it's easier to kill them. Like shooting fish in a barrel. All right, son. You said you wanted to learn from me. Learn from this. This is the kind of evil that comes with progress. Afraid he's right, son. What kind of a monster passes his evil on to children? They burn this with everything else. Presented by... My blanket, John. You're safe. I don't have anything to say to you. What you did today speaks loud enough. I went to the Indian village. It's time you saw the way the world works, old man. Is that what the government pays you for? to destroy the Indian nation? No. no. They pay me for planting the seeds of a new nation. How I do it's up to me. Ah, yes. Progress. That's right. And those that stand in the way of progress just have to be plowed under. <laughs> you gave your words to the world. But somehow, you always ran out of them around me, didn't you? Oh, no. Are you telling me that you've done all this just to punish me? You really think you're that important? Thank you. the strength to do something that I should have done a long time ago. Don't make me responsible for your actions. I'm not. I'm holding myself responsible for your actions. 